There are two main types of functions in Python. The first one is called built-in functions, which are those functions that are already present in Python and you can use them by writing their names. The syntax of this type of function is that you write down the name of the function followed by open parentheses, then an argument, and then close parentheses. An example of this one includes print function. So you write down print and open close parentheses and in between you write down an argument. The argument could be a string like hello world in a string format or an integer or a mathematical operation. There is more to it and we are going to go through all of the functionalities of print function in later videos. There are other built-in functions in Python. These include count function, len function, range, string, int, float, input, and many others. So let's try to have a look at print function. So we have a variable here, x equals 2, y equals 3, and z equals 5. So we can print them out by writing down print, open parentheses, x, comma, y, comma, z, comma, s, e, p, which is a separator, equals, and in between quotations we write down a sign. We can also print out all of them together like 2, 3, 5. You can do mathematical operations like x plus y plus z and it will sum them up. When you press enter it would be 10. You can also do conversions of the variables. So for example you convert x to string. It will show you x in a string format. If you sum two variables that have been converted to string like print str x plus str y let's say it will actually put them next to each other like 2 and 3 so this is not 23 because this that was a string however if you sum them up it would become 5 because the sum of 2 and 3 is 5 so that was built in function in python the second type of functions in Python is called custom-made functions in which you create your own functions depending on your needs. The syntax of this type of function is that you write down def short for define to define a function and then the name of the function that you want it could be any name followed by open parentheses and variables then close the parentheses and colon. Then after that you indent arguments, you write down arguments and then you write down return, open parentheses and the variable that you would like to return and close parentheses. So let's create a function that can square a number. You write down def, a name like square, open parentheses and a variable, close parentheses, colon and press enter. Then declare another variable, let's say sq equals x multiplied by x to square it, then return sq press enter. To use this you write down square open parentheses a number to pass the number to the function then it will square it. You can test this on any kind of variable or any kind of number and it will return the square value the number could be float or integer. So that's how you create a function that can perform something for you.